Hello Darts Nuts, welcome to Darts Review Channel. Got a very nice set of darts here for review and these are the Shot Pro Series Store Bunts Darts. Let's check them out. So the darts are only available in 23 gram in steel tip, 19 gram in soft tip, the 90% tungsten and the retail for £69.95. So as you can see it comes in this cardboard packaging and inside you've got a form insert all and everything in place when I can get it out and it comes supplied with the carbon towel in between stems and the Pro Series small standard 100 micron flights. That's fit with a black coat of point. It's a classic straight barrel ring grip style. Quite a long barrel. I think it was around about 55 mil or something like that. You got a tapered bull nose and then at the front you got a fairly flat chunky ring grip. And obviously there's a couple of DSSs on here, dreaded smooth sections. I guess you could call that one there, but I I think it's all kind of like a continuation of that, but slightly wider. But then you got a normal ring style grip so but the midsection again you've got another DSS with the radiation nuke symbol on it and then some more of the flat square edged ring grip and then another smooth section on the rear with the player's name but these kind of darts tend to suit people that like to spread the fingers along the barrel um, but it's not always the case I mean I'm sure there'll be lots of front grippers out there who like a long barrel just as there probably is some with grippers there as well so again it's what works with your your grip and how you throw but just a kind of a classic style simple but probably very functional for most and fitted with the carbon tau tweeny stems and the pro series standard flights this kind of like see-through so you got a tapered bull nose and then a, a flat chunky ring grip with fairly wide grooves in between and then I guess you could call it a DSS, dreaded smooth section and then some normal thin ring and groove grip and then a slightly wider DSS with the radiation type nuke symbol on it some more flat ring and groove grip and then a, a smooth section on the air on the, on the air, on the rear with the bunts name on it so that's the super close look at the shot store Bunt stats. The darts fit with a black coat of 28mm point. You've got a tapered bull nose, that's 3mm, and then a chunky wide ring and groove grip, 12mm, smooth band, 3.8mm, then some thin ring and groove grip, that's 10mm, and then you've got a smooth section of 8mm, and then you've got some more of the thin ring and groove grip, that's 7mm, and then a smooth section on the end of the barrel, that's 11mm, length 54.8mm, width 6mm. Twenty three point two grams, twenty three point eighteen grams, and twenty three point two two grams. Full set up, twenty four point seven six grams. Here's the balance with nothing attached and with the supplied setup. And this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights. So it's mostly a low level grip dart. It's only really the thin rings that are grippiest, maybe about five for them. I'm trying to flip, throw them a bit flatter. It's normally a fine with a long barrel. If you throw it a bit flat, it tends to work better. I don't think they'll work with my loopy style of throw. And also with me being a front gripper, usually with a long barrel like this, 55 mil, kind of spirals and fish tails and lands in the board a bit funny sometimes. So I think if you've got a, 
harder, flatter throw. I think they'll work perfect with that style. Like chucking spears. Some of them I'm getting through the air quite nice. Seem to be slightly improving each time, but not on target. Yeah, I got one in. Ah, treble one champion. It actually looks quite nice when you when you get it to fly nice. Release it nice and flat. It looks quite nice through the air. Yes, kind of got the hang of it there, I think. <laughs> I'll try it from the midsection. I'll be there forever trying with my front grip. <laughs> um, I think the mid part is probably half on that ring grip and half on that radiation symbol. <laughs> A little bit more grippy there as well, like on them rings. Yeah, you got a treble. So, although I think it's a, with it being long dart, it's probably good for people that like to spread, but the fingers along it. But I think for mid grippers, definitely a bit more nicer balance. So for the rear, I'll try it. Again, probably half on the rings and half on the smooth part. I don't think this is going to go well. <laughs> yeah, quite a bit fishtaily. Was not as bad as I was expecting. One more try from the rear, <laughs> just to see if I can get a twenty. <laughs> See, it kind of like flicks up and then it, it almost goes like that through the air for me, but if you're a natural rear gripper, then it's not going to do that for you, obviously. Nah. All right, what I wanted was one single 20. Come on, I've got to have another go. <laughs> I'm just going to go right on the rings this time. I'm not going to go on the smooth part. <laughs> That went through the air nice, but I couldn't get it to go. Yeah, at least I got a 20. <laughs> but not for me, probably. <laughs> but like I say, if you are a rear or mid gripper and you like to spread your fingers along, like hold it on your thumbs, put them two fingers either side or whatever you like to do, you'll probably be happy with it, with it being a long barrel. If you're a front gripper who likes to grip right on the nose, probably not the best for you but then again some front grippers it depends if it works with your throw and if you've got a flattish hard throw you'll probably be okay There's one. Ah, oh, no, double three. I 
think that's in. Yeah, the five's in, that's two. Six was close. Two. There's three. There's four. That's better. Better than two anyway. <laughs> Come on, one more. Get five at least. No, oh, come on. Yes. Five it is. Three points. Thirty-three points. Wrong treble. A miles away. Three points. Troubles, fifty points. Two twenty fives, fifty points. Ah. 125, 75 after six starts. Ah, oh, come on. 125, that's 100 after nine. Bullseye, 150 after 12, last three. Oh, nice deflection into the bullseye. I'll take it. Uh, that's 225, yay! Doubles, 1 to ball, 5, I'm not sure if 5 is the most common I've had up to now, I thought it was 6 but it looks like it's 5 and 30 darts at 20, I've got 33 and 180 around the clock 50 and the bulls, my old favourite, 225, It's quite a lot of them <laughs> So there you go, that's the shot store 
Bunstarts, quite an interesting name that isn't it? I don't think I've ever heard of anyone called Stowe before, or Bunts <laughs> for that matter. Um, but he yeah, has been playing, playing well, so I don't know what he's going to be doing in his match on the World Championship, which is on tonight, and it's probably been and finished by the time this goes out, but hopefully he'll do well. Um, I think I've done better with these than I was expecting, because like I say, I'm not really a fan of long barrels, but um, as I got warmed up with them, they did start the flying through the air a lot better and smoother, so again, it could be just one of them darts that I'd have to play with for longer to get more used to it, but I think it probably suits people that have got a flatter, harder throw more than my kind of loopy style so anyway i hope you've enjoyed watching the video i'll leave you with the gallery as usual and i'll see you on the next one enjoy the darts happy darting